good morning dear students i welcome all of you in my english classes today i am going to teach you the second part of the story footprints without feet in my study class i taught you the first part of the story but before i take you to the second part of the story just pay attention to these important terms that you will uh, need in order to understand the story the first is the first term is indian it is the name of a remote village in england next is mrs hall she is a landlord and the last one is mr jaffer mr jaffer is a constable of who was called for to arrest the griffin that we will uh, come to know about the end of the story Now, first, I would like to recap the story. So far, you know that Griffin was a British scientist. He discovered a rare drug to become invisible. He tried the drug on himself and become invisible, but he didn't know how to reverse the action. He decided to uh, carry on his experiment to get drug for the. reverse action so he left his home took a room on rent and started doing his experiments but because of the feud with the landlord he became angry and set the house of the landlord to fire and flee and fled from it thereafter he uh, starts wandering here and there in search of a uh, safe place uh, to get his requirement and in order to do so he commit he committed theft in a departmental store and thereafter in a uh, saw that sold articles for the theater people when he uh, commit theft in the theater people he uh, managed to get uh, some important dresses which uh, he needed to keep himself visible so that he may not have any difficulties in fulfilling his uh, his requirement so what kind of dresses he managed uh, to get in the theoretical shop he got a bandage to cover his forehead he got a big whisker uh, to cover up his uh, both both of his cheeks he got an artificial nose and a dark glass and uh, and after uh, getting this thing came out of the shop just uh, wounded the shopkeeper robbed the money the shopkeeper had and fled from there this was the first part now come to the second part my dear students the theft incident in the departmental store and the shop of a theoretical company made griffin a subject of talk among the people of london city the talk of griffin was so intensive that griffin came to understand that while living in the cities of london he would not be able to uh, live in peace and uh, also uh, not be able to carry on his experiments peacefully so he decided to leave the cities of london and go to a remote part of the country he had money already you know usne ye dukandar ko loot kar kuch rupaye le liye the uske paas paise the उस पैसे का इस्तेमाल वह लंदन से दूर जाने के लिए करता है कैसे कि ही टू के ट्रेन एंड केम टू इपिंग जिस वक्त वह इपिंग पहुंचा उस वक्त इपिंग में बड़े कराते की ठंड पड़ रही थी ठीक है इट वॉज सो मच कोल्ड दैट दैट ग्रिफिन फाउंड इट वेरी हार्ड टू बी इन द हाउस फॉर लॉन्ग उसे कोई स्थल की जरूरत थी जहाँ वह रुक सकता था और ठंड से अपने आप को बचा सकता था उसने देखा कि वहाँ पर एक इन है एक धर्मशाला है 
उसने यह सोचकर कि उस धर्मशाला में उसे रहने के लिए रिक्वायर्ड रूम रेंट पर मिल जाएगा वह तो धर्मशाला के पास पहुंचा और उसने एक रूम को रेंट पर ले लिया धर्मशाला की मालकी थी मिसेज हॉल है ना ही गॉट ए रूम ऑन रेंट एंड स्टार्टेड लिविंग देयर कैरिंग आउट हिज एक्सपेरिमेंट्स बच्चों जब वह इन पहुँचा था तो उसके आश्चर्यजनक वेशभूषा को देखकर सारे लोग ग्रिफिन की चर्चा किया करते थे लेकिन मिसेज हॉल सारे लोगों को यह कहकर शांत कर देती थी कि उसका जो गेस्ट है ही वॉज ए साइंटिस्ट एंड उसके जो चेहरे बड़ा बड़ा अजीब लगता है वह ऐसा इसलिए कि एक एक्सीडेंट में वह घायल हो गया था इसीलिए अपने चेहरे को छुपाने के लिए उसने अपने फोर हेड पर बैंडेज लगा रखा है और अपने गालों के ऊपर उसने घिसकर लगा रखा है मिसेज हॉल का यह बात सुनकर सारे लोग शांत हो जाते बट मिसेज हॉल हर से वॉज ए लिटिल बिट सस्पिशस ऑफ द स्ट्रेंजर सी वॉन्टेड टू नो हु द स्ट्रेंजर वॉज वेयर हैड ही कम फ्रॉम बट वेन एवर सी वेन टू दी स्ट्रेंजर एंड आस्ट क्वेश्चन द स्ट्रेंजर हैंडेड है हाई हैंडेडली यूजिंग वर्ड्स दैट वेयर नॉट सुटेबल टू यूज फॉर ए लेडी लाइक मिसेज हॉल इट वॉज ए दे वेयर द इंसल्टिंग वर्ड्स बट मिसेज हॉल वेंट ऑन टॉलरेटिंग ऑल द इंसल्ट फॉर द फैक्ट दैट द स्ट्रेंजर वॉज पेइंग हिम रेंट इन एडवांस एंड द मनी Uh, being paid as rent was uh, enough for Mrs. Hall to maintain his domestic affairs. Mrs. Uh, Hall के इनकम का साधन मात्र वही धर्मशाला पर दिए किराए पर दिए जाने वाला रूम था जब भी कोई यात्री आते उस धर्मशाला में ठहरते और उन्हीं से जो उनको इनकम होता था उन्हीं से उनका घर चल जाता था अभी आपको मैंने जस्ट बताया कि उस समय टिपिंग में बड़ी कराके की ठंड पड़ रही थी और कोई यात्री आ नहीं रहे थे धर्मशाला में ठहरने के लिए तब उनका इनकम काफ़ी कम है है ना इसीलिए वह यह जानते हुए भी कि स्ट्रेंजर जिसको वह मकान किराए पर देने जा रही हैं वह एक संदेहास्पद व्यक्ति है उन्होंने पैसे की खातिर उसे मकान किराए पर दे दिया बच्चों फॉर सम मंथ्स एवरी थिंग वेंट एज यूजल ग्रिफिन वेंट ऑन पेइंग रेंट्स But a day came when the money Griffin had was spent. Now Griffin had no money to pay rent. Whenever Mrs. Hall asked Griffin to pay the rent, Griffin just told her to wait for some days because his check was to arrive. इस तरह से मिसेज हॉल भी शांत हो जाती वह सोचती कि उसका चेक आएगा वह पेमेंट कर देगा और फिर सब कुछ धीरे धीरे कुछ दिन तक सामान्य ढंग से चलता रहा जस्ट आफ्टर ए फ्यू डेज टू स्ट्रेंज इवेंट्स टू प्लेस देर वॉज द हाउस ऑफ ए कलर्जी मैन एट सम डिस्टेंस वेरी अर्ली इन द मॉर्निंग अराउंड थ्री और फोर ओ क्लॉक बिफोर द सनराइज द कलर्जी मैन एंड हिज वाइफ Woke up in the by uh, after hearing noise in the study. They wanted to know what was happening there. So both husband and wife came down and uh, stood uh, in front of the study and wanted to uh, get an idea standing outside. After some time, उन्होंने note को गिनने की आवाज़ सुनी. चिंक ऑफ दी नोट्स उन्होंने सुन दे वी कैन कन्फर्म दैट सम बडी वॉज इन साइड द रूम एंड दे वे आर टेकिंग द मनी केप्ट फॉर दी टू मेंटेन दी हाउस होल्ड ये अफेयर्स प्लगिंग करे बोथ हस्बैंड एंड वाइफ एंटर्ड दी इन साइड दे फाउंड नो वन बट साउंड वॉज कमिंग फ्रॉम सम so they went to the kitchen they went to the bathroom area dining room everywhere they suspected a being there they uh, wandered all around uh, the house but no one was found when she 
finally came to the study, she noted that the housekeeping money was not there. So it was confirmed that somebody was there who committed theft and, and took up the housekeeping money. The, just, just at the same time, inside the, in the inn, they took an, another, another unusual incident. The Mr. Hall and Mrs. Hall got up around 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. It was a period just before the sundown. Usually, when they got up, they used to remain around his bedroom only. But on that day, she came out of her bedroom, of their bedroom, and they started moving here and there. They came to the house they had given to the stranger on them and they were surprised to find that the room was wide open. Usually it remained closed and shut. Both husband and wife grew suspicious. What was the matter? What could be the reason? They wanted to investigate whether the stranger was there or not. Or what happened? How come the room, the door of the room was open? So they went in, looked around, but the stranger was not inside. The bandage of the stranger, his disguise, his artificial nose were kept on the bed. His head was kept on a bed post. Before Mrs. Hall could understand anything. The hat kept on the bed post, left in the air and dashed against the face of Mrs. Hall. She felt pain, but she didn't understand what happened. Again, just after the minute, the chair kept inside the room, sprang up in the air and hit Mrs. Hall. Soon after, the, the, the chair in the air pushed back both husband and wife outside the room and the room was closed. Mrs. Hall fell down on the stairs, went down and started crying. The room had become haunted. But if you want to see it, but people want to see it, that whatever is in the room is happening, वह बड़ा अनुजवल है। लोग यह विश्वास करने लगे कि स्ट्रेंजर एक सस्पेक्टेड व्यक्ति है और जो कुछ भी उपद्रव मच रहा है, वो उस सारे उपद्रव के जड़ में यही एक व्यक्ति है, तो इस व्यक्ति को पकड़ना काफी जरूरी है। So the police station was informed and the police station deputed Mr. Jaffer to go to EP and arrest the person. Okay? This week, Mrs. Hall brought Sahas Karte, who was Griffin Ke Pass Gai, and who was a very good person, 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 उसके प्रस्तल लाइफ से रिलेटेड कोई सवाल पूछे, जैसे ही मिसेज बॉल ने उससे कुछ सवाल पूछे, मिस्टर ग्रिफिन लॉस्ट हिस टेंपर एंड इमीडिएटली ही स्टार्टेड रिमूविंग हिस क्लोथ्स फ्रॉम इट ही रिमूव्ड हिस टर्बन सॉरी ये बैंडेज ही रिमूव्ड हिस आर्टिफिशियल नोज हिस विस्कर्स एंड दी एंड द पार्ट ऑफ ह about the soldiers became invisible. Mrs. Hall saw a person without her and she was terrified. Some other person came there. They also saw a person without her and not terrified. And they started running away from there. In the meantime, Mr. Deva arrived on the scene and he moved ahead to arrest the group to arrest Griffin. But as Griffin saw 
a police person was coming to arrest him, he removed all his clothes and became completely invisible. Now, it was not possible for Mr. Jaffer to arrest Griffin because his body was not visible. Taking advantage of the situation, Griffin gave a good blow to Mr. Jaffer. Mr. Jaffer fell on the ground and Griffin went away to an unknown area and their story comes to an end. So this was for today. Thank you very much.